Physical soft keys are available on the CQ12T and CQ18T and are available for all CQs through the CQ Mixpad app. To set these up, go to the config screen and then the control and network tab. Select a key at the top, then use the drop down boxes to select the function. Soft keys can be used for things like the tap tempo of a tap delay unit, to mute channels, or switch processing in and out. They can also be used for scene controls, or to start and stop recordings. Touch each key to set it up individually. Alternatively, a foot switch can be used to control the same options. Connect a single or dual foot switch to the TRS jack connection, then run through the calibration to set whether you're using momentary or latching switches. You can also select soft latch here to use a momentary switch as if it were a latching switch. Once calibrated, just select the function in the same way as with soft keys. Note that a single foot switch will generally just use the tip connection. In addition to its soft keys, the CQ18T also features soft rotaries, which are very similar to soft keys, but control variable parameters, like thresholds, gains, pans, or send levels instead. Set these up in the same way as soft keys by selecting a rotary at the top, selecting a function, and then selecting channels and parameters using the other selection boxes that appear. Soft rotaries can also be used as smart rotaries. This mode can be turned on and off at the bottom left of the screen with any soft rotary selected, but note that it does affect all of them. Smart rotaries follow you through the CQ during mixing and allow instant hands-on control of parameters in each screen. In the processing bank view, we can see they're controlling gain, pan and main level for the selected channel, indicated by coloured dots on the screen that match the colour of the smart rotary LEDs. Or in the PEQ screen here, you can see they're controlling the parameters for the selected frequency band. 